Hello everyone, I'm quickly moving on to the video and I'm ranking the protagonists in Silent Hill. Enjoy watching. In the Silent Hill game, the story revolves around Harry Mason's quest to find his daughter Cheryl in the mysterious town of Silent Hill. Harry is a man attempting to connect with his daughter after the death of his wife, the novelist Jody. At the beginning of the game, Cheryl goes missing after a car accident, plunging Harry into a series of eerie and terrifying events. Throughout Silent Hill, Harry confronts supernatural entities, dreamlike realms, and dark secrets. As he strives to find Cheryl, he faces his own fears and learns about the ominous history of Silent Hill. Harry Mason serves not only as a character controlled by players, but also as a narrative device that enhances the atmosphere and horror elements of the game. As one of the iconic characters in the Silent Hill series, Harry provides players with an opportunity to explore their own internal conflicts and fears. As a result, I'm placing Harry Mason in Silent Hill 1 in the A tier. Silent Hill 2 stands as a pinnacle in horror gaming, largely due to the intricate portrayal of its central character, James Sunderland. Introduced as an ordinary man seeking his late wife, Mary, James's story unfolds into a complex narrative of supernatural horrors intertwined with a profound sense of guilt. The game skillfully employs symbolism, transforming Silent Hill into a nightmarish reflection of James's inner demons. At its core, Silent Hill 2 delves into the psychological facets of James's character. His journey through the eerie town becomes a symbolic exploration of guilt, grief, and the blurred lines between reality and nightmare. What sets this game apart is its multiple endings, each revealing different aspects of James's personality and actions, leaving players to grapple with the moral ambiguity of his choices. In essence, James Sunderland serves as the linchpin of Silent Hill 2, elevating it beyond a mere horror game into a profound examination of the human psyche. His haunting journey challenges players to confront their own fears and morality, solidifying the game's status as a timeless classic in the horror genre. As a result, I'm placing James Sunderland in Silent Hill 2 in the S tier. Silent Hill 3 introduces players to Heather Mason, a character whose life takes a terrifying turn as she becomes entangled in the dark mysteries of the eerie town. Heather, initially portrayed as a normal teenager, is soon confronted by nightmarish creatures and a disturbing reality. As the daughter of Harry Mason, a character from the first Silent Hill game, Heather's journey becomes a descent into a twisted world that blurs the lines between nightmares and reality. The game masterfully explores Heather's resilience in the face of unspeakable horrors as she unravels the secrets of her past and the malevolent forces that seek her. Silent Hill 3 is not just a tale of survival. It's a psychological journey through Heather's fears and the unsettling truths she discovers. In essence, Heather Mason stands as a compelling protagonist in Silent Hill 3, embodying the game's theme of psychological horror and survival in a world gone awry. As a result, I'm placing Heather Mason in Silent Hill 3 in the S tier. Silent Hill 4. The room introduces players to Henry Townsend, a character whose life takes a surreal turn when he finds himself trapped in his own apartment. Unlike previous Silent Hill protagonists, Henry starts as an unwitting participant in the town's horrors. As players guide Henry through the nightmarish dimensions accessible through a mysterious hole in his bathroom, they uncover a narrative rich in psychological horror. Henry's journey is marked by eerie encounters, disturbing entities, and a sense of isolation that sets Silent Hill 4 apart from its predecessors. What makes Henry unique is his involuntary connection to the malevolent forces at play. The game's chilling atmosphere and Henry's reluctant role in the unfolding events add a layer of tension and mystery. Silent Hill 4 explores themes of imprisonment and psychological torment, keeping players on edge as they navigate Henry through a world that blurs the line between reality and nightmare. In essence, Henry Townshend's story in Silent Hill 4. The room offers a fresh perspective within the Silent Hill universe, delivering a compact yet intense experience that immerses players in a psychological thriller. 
As a result, I'm placing Henry Townshend in Silent Hill 4, the room in the B tier. Silent Hill Origins introduces players to Travis Grady, a truck driver whose journey takes a nightmarish turn when he stumbles upon the eerie town of Silent Hill. Travis is a character shrouded in mystery, haunted by his own traumatic past. As players guide Travis through the fog-shrouded streets, they uncover the unsettling origins of Silent Hill. Travis's personal demons intertwine with the town's malevolent forces, creating a harrowing experience that explores themes of guilt, redemption, and psychological torment. Travis's character development is central to the game's narrative, and players witness his descent into the surreal horrors of Silent Hill. The game masterfully blends atmospheric tension with psychological horror, keeping players on the edge of their seats. In essence, Travis Grady is a compelling protagonist whose journey in Silent Hill Origins adds layers to the town's enigmatic history. His story serves as a chilling prelude to the Silent Hill series, providing players with a glimpse into the origins of the nightmarish realm that continues to captivate and terrify gamers worldwide. As a result, I'm placing Travis Grady in Silent Hill Origins in the C tier. In Silent Hill Homecoming, the protagonist, Alex Shepard, takes center stage in a harrowing tale of family and horror. Returning home from military service to search for his missing brother, Joshua, Alex finds himself entangled in the eerie and nightmarish town of Silent Hill. Haunted by disturbing visions and grotesque monsters, Alex's journey becomes a psychological descent into his own past and the dark secrets of his family. The game skillfully weaves a narrative that blurs the lines between reality and delusion, challenging players to navigate the twisted corridors of Alex's fractured mind. As players unravel the mysteries of Silent Hill alongside Alex, the game explores themes of guilt, betrayal, and the consequences of one's actions. The town itself becomes a malevolent force, reflecting and amplifying Alex's inner turmoil. In summary, Alex Shepard in Silent Hill Homecoming presents players with a gripping narrative, combining psychological horror with familial tension. His quest to uncover the truth about his brother and confront his own demons delivers a haunting experience within the unsettling confines of Silent Hill. As a result, I'm placing Alex Shepard in Silent Hill Homecoming in the C tier. In Silent Hill Downpour, players step into the shoes of Murphy Pendleton, a convict with a troubled past. Murphy's journey into the ominous town is not by choice, but a consequence of a prison transfer gone awry. Haunted by a personal tragedy, Murphy finds himself entangled in the nightmarish realm of Silent Hill. Downpour emphasizes psychological horror, exploring Murphy's inner demons and the consequences of his actions. The game masterfully combines atmospheric tension with Murphy's quest for redemption, creating a gripping narrative that keeps players on the edge. Silent Hill Downpour adds a layer of complexity to the series by intertwining Murphy's story with the supernatural forces that define Silent Hill. As players guide Murphy through the eerie landscapes and face the town's malevolent entities, they witness a character struggling with guilt and the desire for absolution. The narrative twists and turns offer a unique perspective on Silent Hill's psychological horrors, making Murphy Pendleton a memorable addition to the series. As a result, I'm placing Murphy Pendleton in Silent Hill Downpour in the B tier. In Silent Hill Shattered Memories, Harry Mason embarks on a desperate quest to find his missing adopted daughter, Cheryl, in the chilling town of Silent Hill. The game takes a unique approach, reshaping the narrative based on player choices and psychological profiling. Harry is portrayed as a loving father, driven by concern and determination. As he navigates through the icy and eerie landscapes of Silent Hill, the boundaries between reality and nightmare blur. The game's psychological elements add depth to Harry's character, revealing aspects of his personality through therapy sessions and player decisions. Shattered Memories provides a fresh perspective on the Silent Hill universe, with Harry Mason at the forefront of a psychological horror experience. The game's narrative twists and the emotional weight of Harry's journey make it a standout entry in the Silent Hill series. As a result, I'm placing Harry Mason in Silent Hill Shattered Memories in the A-tier. 
The video ends here. In your opinion, who is the best protagonist in Silent Hill? Write in the comments and let's discuss. See you in another video. Don't forget to subscribe.